Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Cross! Let's head on up to the third floor of Chronopolis. We've only got so many flo many floors to go, but so much plot to dump on you today, viewers, so let's get to it. Now, uh, I've already cleared out the enemies here. There'd normally be some robots floating around, but I figured I'd spare you that part. So let's see what they got going on in here. Well, some heavy-duty equipment. DNA record. Oh. Okay. Oh, so... Well, yeah, they do have access to the frozen flame. We already kind of knew about that. That's weird. Let's see what this thing does. Uh, can I do anything with it? Huh. I could have sworn I could do something with that. Hmm. Maybe I gotta come back in a moment. Now, let's just grab this rainbow shell here. Well, that was easy. Hey, they got pictures of Lavos here. Well, if you really want to read all this, well, pause, viewers, but I'm assuming that you've played Chrono Trigger or watched my videos of it, so it's basically just a recap for those who haven't played it before. Oh, well, what, shouldn't they know about Lavos? Somehow? I mean, hey, they can practically control time. Maybe they haven't gotten there yet. Oh, okay, yeah, you see, when we uh, saved the world in the first game, then, well, this new future came to exist, and, well, that's where this city came from, although why it's in uh, 1020 AD, I don't know yet, but we'll find out! Ah, well, you're in 1000 AD, Lavos should still be around. What about the reptites? Oh. Yeah, I suppose so, huh? Wasn't that, uh, what was it, that Giant's Claw area? That wasn't on the main continent, but maybe it was, I forget exactly where it was. It's been a couple, well, well, since the Let's Play that I did since I played Chrono Trigger, but yeah. Almost a couple years. Oh, yeah. Sure, why not? see anything interesting here oh yeah DNA I thought it was trillions of cells but I'll be honest with you viewers biology was not my strong subject here well there you go let me check out that machine there one more time I could have sworn there is something that these thing this thing does huh okay I guess I was wrong okay well let's just move on to the next room Apparently they know about Lavos and they got the frozen flame and everything, but what does that have to do with anything? Hmm. Maybe this room can uh, shed some light on that. Oh, more brain activity. I guess this is the biology wing of the city, huh? Okay, well then let's uh, check it out. Or not. Oh, okay. What do they care about brains for? Brains. Brains! They must be zombies here. No, no. Huh? I can barely read that. Uh, that's not much better. Okay, I guess. Oh! Oh, okay. Really? Huh? It's just like the Matrix. Oh, so that's why they're uh, studying brain activity. Oh, well, yeah, that's easy enough. They can create souls! Well, that's weird. Ah, oh, well. Okay, fair enough. Oh, and they can even control emotions, too, huh? They can control just about everything! Records of fate, huh? So basically, the records of fate, like those save points, the reason why it's telling us what to do is because, well, someone's controlling it and telling us what to do, and it manipulates our brain waves or genetic code or something like that. Uh, basically, these guys are controlling everything, except us for some reason, or at least not entirely. They didn't seem to do a very good job of keeping Surge from getting to the frozen flame with that. But, whatever. 
What's, uh, I don't know what an anthropod is. I'll be honest with you. Oh, well that's no good. Oh, well actually, yeah, that is pretty good. Oh, well, maybe not. Oh, I thought we just evolved because, you know, we were allowed to live, you know? Because the reptites didn't live, but I guess I was wrong. Oh, well that's no good. Well, who cares about that point of view? <laughs> nah, just kidding. Uh oh, we got a giant robot here. Now this guy is probably going to be a little bit too hard for Surge to take on by himself. I mean, look at him, he's huge! He's got over 2,000 HP, so... But fortunately, uh, we do have Fargo with us. In fact, this guy is one of the big reasons why I am bringing Fargo along. So let's take him out. Stone weapons are pretty effective on him, so... Let's just go a couple fierce attacks. Bring him down as much as we can. Gunner get you. Yeah, that's great. He's got a freaking minigun on him! What the? How fair is that? Well, I can do more damage to you than you can do to me. Let's see. Yeah, then we want to Eagle Eye Fargo there. Uh, Surge is level 7 tech. Not too effective against him. Fargo's level 7 tech. Much more effective on him. So, that should be able to finish him off. Not bad for Fargo. Or for a pirate there. The Invincible! I am invincible! Why do you think I use these cigars so much? Would you like a cigar? I didn't think so. Yay! Okay, well I think that's all of the new enemies here, but let's grab this hellbound element. Well, I guess we are hellbound now. Look at this place, man. This place is full of jerks. Okay, well, let's head on up to the final floor. Well, actually, there's a basement level, but, yeah, we don't have a key card to go there yet, so let's just head on up, then. Music here kind of reminds me of Goldeneye with that <laughs> instrument. What is that instrument, anyway? I don't know what that is. But I do know that we got a lot of new enemies here for me to take out off-screen. I know that instrument is like some percussion instrument, but I can't put my finger on what it is. I've never heard it anywhere besides Goldeneye, really. Oh. Oh, well, okay. Huh, well, where is that Arbiter? I wonder who it is, anyway. Hmm. Well, we'll be back there later. Let's check out this room here. See what's going on. Hey, how's it going? Well, looks like they're running something going on around here. What is that thing anyway? See that there's a grid going on up there? Oh, so that's how the time egg works. I always thought it was just magic, but okay. Shouldn't they know? Eh. Have any of you guys ever seen the movie Tron? No, 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 yes. Uh, I mean, no. Oh, well there you go. Sounds like a plan. How hard could it be? Well, yeah, I mean, you guys are here. They, they seem to at least know that they exist because we interfered or something like that. I wonder why they only know certain bits and pieces of our adventure from the last game. And what research is that? You're not going to tell us, are you? Nuts. Oh well. Well, maybe we can find him. Well, yeah. Yeah, of course. What utter nonsense. This is Chrono Cross. Well, let's see what these guys can tell us. I don't know what phase metastasis is, but whatever. Hey, are you gonna say anything? Oh, 
Would that be the Guardia regime? I don't think we ever find out. Oh, yeah, we're just BSing the government for their tax dollars to do all this stuff. Uh, we're creating a time weapon. Well, they did that in Voyager, I think. Huh. Okay, let's head on over here. Then. Let's head on back here. I suppose I could have come here earlier, but from the third floor, but eh, whatever. Hey, okay, how's it going? Oh. Oh, okay, well, I guess that's where the dock is. What exactly are they doing with their experiments? What does this have to do with us? Find out next time on Let's Play Chrono Cross! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.